Okay. Thank you, Gary. Um, we had a board member resign recently, John Niebling, um, had to step down from the board. And this is after nine years of service on the TACA board, of course, broken up for when he termed out, but then he came back for more. And during that time, he was usually either secretary or president. So a um, big thanks to John for um, all of his service. And I can personally say he has served as a mentor, a historian, and a scholar for me. Um, we're very lucky he has agreed to continue in his role as secretary. So we won't have a vacancy there. Um, and he doesn't know it, but he's also continuing in his role as mentor and scholar and historian for me. Uh, so today we are meeting to um, fill the vacant board seat. And we will um, have a motion. And before we vote, we will have discussion. I have a motion. Does anybody? Go ahead, I'm... Andy. Do you hear me? Can y'all hear me? Yeah, you're just fine, Andy. Do what? I can hear you just fine. Okay. Well, I would like to um, nominate uh, Cheryl <laughs> Terra. Uh, the back, the last name gives me a hard time. Uh, as to replace John on the board, is that I'm your motion? Yes, I'm second sorry, it. that is my motion. Cheryl Terra. 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 Real hard so time easy. with that. Sorry. Terra. Yeah, I would like and to. And Joe, that. Joe seconded. Okay, thanks, Andy and Joe. And um, we've we've had a lot of discussion. And we feel very lucky because um, Cheryl brings um, a lot of HOA board experience to us, um, including writing DCCRs, and she she just is very knowledgeable there. A lot of construction experience, which I think we've all realized that um, Cameron is 50 years old and we're having a lot of construction things going on. So that seemed like a great fit. Um, she is great with management. She manages over 250 employees. She does the accounting and the payroll for those. Uh, she has served TACO on our budget committee. Um, and she has done some things for the board this year, including writing up a bid for lock replacements so that we could get the best deal possible for owners. Of course, now that we're um, wanting to bring Cheryl on the board. We won't be able to use her company for that, but we really appreciated all of the efforts she went to to um, help ensure that that our, our owners get the best possible options. Um, I think, Cheryl, did you help with architectural control at some point? For the McDowell Mountain, I did. So okay. I've had our, yeah, I've been on the architectural committee here, but not there. Okay. Okay, so um, just a great fit with with her involvement on other HOAs and her involvement and her eagerness on our HOA. She actually expressed an interest in being on the board before we had an opening. So we just feel very, very lucky to have her. And um, I, I want to open up for board members if you guys have any additional comments to share. Stacy, you covered it for me. Thanks. Okay. Anyone else? Great. I'm good. I'm good. Okay. I'm good. I agree. And how about owners? We don't have very many on the call or in the room, but uh, we do open up for comments from owners as well. Stacy, I'd like to say that I, I value y'all's opinion on a lot of it. And I, so not that my Two cents really matters a whole lot in this case, but I I, I approve of it, which it, whatever I can. So thank you. Thank you, Scott. Thank you very much. Anyone else? Okay. Then all in favor of appointing Cheryl Terhart to the open board seat. 
Aye. 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 Okay, did I hear Greg too? Aye, yes. Okay, okay, thanks. I told John I would take notes for him, so I have to make sure I hear everybody. Okay, any opposed? Great. Well, Cheryl, welcome to the TACO board. And uh, thank you for stepping up and and for all that you have done and you're about to do. <laughs> appreciate it. Appreciate everybody's confidence. Thank you so very much. I look forward to working with everybody that's on this call and, and all of the owners throughout our property. So thank you for this for this wonderful, wonderful day today for me being put on the board. Thank you. Oh, I forgot to mention, Cheryl, I wanted to mention because people ask you that you are uh, you own two units in the lodge and one at High Point. Um, yeah. Yes, correct. 602, I'm actually right next door to Chris. So 602, 603 at High Point and or 16417 over at the lodge. OK, great. All I right. Have, I have a question, Stacy. Yes. It's a question for Andy. Andy, are you going to slough off? The rules and regs on to Cheryl now. <laughs> that could be arranged. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> no, no, no. I've I've ordered a sheriff's badge for Andy and deputy <laughs> badges for his committee, and it we, we've got well, to get this in. I'll have you know that our committee did an excellent job. We have a few things to go over, but no, I'll stay on as the sheriff, and um, I'm I'm pleased to do that. No problem. You look oh, like a you, you look like a sheriff, Andy. Yeah, I do, don't he I? He does, doesn't he? Okay. <laughs> Anything uh, else from anyone? Nope. Okay, I uh, I make a motion that we adjourn. A second. second. A second or third. Right. Okay. Thanks, everybody. This meeting is adjourned, and hopefully, we'll see you next at the May board meeting. Thanks. Right. Have a great right. week. Bye. Thanks all. Bye. Bye. Bye.